Hello everyone, um, it's Wearing Time and Space and today I will be doing a review on the 5 inch 11th Doctor. <laughs> for the packaging so the doctor is clearly shown in his packaging comes with a sonic screwdriver a flesh packet thing and a flesh mask I got this from Toys R Us today um, Doctor Who logo and the um, doctor now with the flesh and the flesh mask highly de detailed action figure now we take a look at the side, it has a Dot 2 logo, and the other side, same Dot 2 logo, clearly showing off the figure. On the back, we have, now with the flesh and flesh mask, highly put, detailed and posable action figures, and shows the astronaut, the, the gang island doctor with soft effects, the flesh head and hands, with a song from series 5, the Cyberman. And the 11th Doctor. I did see all these figures, but I thought I better get this one because the side I was tempted on the Cyberman, but he, his face didn't look that good because it was a bit the plastic was a bit wonky, so I thought I'd better get him. Um, and there's some legal rubbish and barcode and stuff. And on the bottom, you just see his feet. In a glass. Yeah, so. And now I'm going to open this up and take a look inside. So here's the Doctor out of its packaging and I'm now going to show you the detail. So the face is very similar to Matt Smith and this is the Series 6 version of the 11th Doctor uh, because he has his hair is more on this side than just on the left. Um, his jacket also is very nice with the elbow pads and also the other elbow pad here. Um, the bow tie is also very nice. Uh, it's sort of dark red, very dark red, which also looks good. Um, the t shirt is a bit different to the f Series 5 figure. It's, um, just white, plain white. Um, and his hands are very nice, you can clearly see fingers. I've put the sonic screwdriver in there, so I'll talk about the sonic. Um, it's, uh, it's a bit messy, but not too much, but because I can, I can understand it because it's very small, but it, you can definitely tell what it is, so it looks very nice. Um, the other hand's very nice, the, you can clearly see pockets on the side of the figure uh, and up here as well. Uh, the trousers have a lot of crumpled and creases in them and the boots are just plain black where you can clearly see the laces. So yeah, this has got very good detail as well. So. And the hair is also quite nice. So I'm now going to go on to articulation. Hello, and now I'm going to talk about articulation. So the head does not move at all. I tried quite hard, but it just doesn't move. Uh, the arms at the armpit move um, outwards 90 degrees. And at the tricep, and bicep it turns 306 degrees at the elbow 90 degrees at the um, hand it turns 360 degrees the waist 360 degrees um, at the thighs they turn 306 degrees legs 90 degrees and boots don't turn at all also uh, the sta 
the stand from the 3.75 inch figures uh, fits with his boot perfectly so you just put it on like that and you can just stand up so if you put it on display stand up quite well um, but this also comes with a flesh mask and some flesh goo so the flesh mask I think it's for him, I'm not sure though, but it goes on like that. And it doesn't really look right much, it looks a bit like his massive face. But yeah, it goes on like that. Pretty cool. And then the flesh is sort of this gill y stuff. Ugh. It looks horrible. So now. And then I've talked about the sonic screwdriver as well. So, what do I think of this figure? Well, this figure is has got a lot of accessories, about three. So, the flesh mask, the goo, and if I can find the sonic screwdriver. Where's it gone? Well, the sonic screwdriver as well. Pretty good, a lot of the accessories. And also, um, it... It's highly detailed, very good articulation, not the best, but all the good, very good all the same. And so I would give this figure probably a 9 out of 10. It's very accurate, you can definitely tell it's Matt Smith. Better than a 3.75 inch figure of him. Compare this. Yeah, it, it looks very different, but different in a good way. So thank you for watching my view. Um, it's... It, I don't know what the next review will be. Might be the Ice Warrior uh, or the Weeping Angel. I don't know. But thank you for watching and bye.